Really quickly before we get into it, I'd just like to say thank you all for, for stopping by and giving my content a chance. If you guys like this video, please make sure to support the channel by sharing it to everyone you know and hitting the like button if you did enjoy this video. This new series on this Mortal Kombat 1 boot camp has, was actually inspired by me from another creator called Uncaged Games. He used to do these back in Mortal Kombat 11 and Injustice 2. If you guys like Netherrealm games, definitely make sure to go check out his content. He's an amazing creator that has given me the inspiration to, uh do this entire series but in regards to reptile our first person running the boot camp gauntlet after a while of me sticking in the training for a while i think i've found the optimal combo for reptile which is not pretty hard at all okay so first you start off with the two three pop up then right from that pop up you're gonna want to do two three three again let's try that one more time two three three then right after that we go right into the two three three and then our cameo which is sonia sonia as our cameo will extend this combo or we could also use frost to um start the combos or so zero similarly but no one else has the pop-up continuer like sonya does so from the sonya continuation we can either do a simple 114 or we can end it off by using our low death roll which is back forward four that basically does the exact same damage as 114 it just gives off more style points you know to be able to hit that death roll at the last second now that's class now moving on we can actually put any of our strings into a combo, the same exact combo as we just did. Take like, if we do back 3-1, right into a spirit ball. Boom! That's 378! And that of course works with any start of any combo string. One thing to note though with the with the 1-1 the one, one spirit ball, first off you have to be careful of the, instead of accidentally spitting the acid, make sure to only press the square twice. Twice, spirit ball. Back jump. Voice spirit ball back jump. Boom. Another 329. This could also work with the 3 1. No back jump needed on that one. 359. Also, some other things to know with the reptile is this this pop up is not safe on block. So, if you notice them trying to block your strikes and they're standing, you can, you can instead of doing a 2 3, you can do a 2 4, which won't, won't get you a combo, but will get you out of having them do a full combo on your ass after they block your shit. So, I'd say that's much better. Also, some notable moves uh, medium distance. If you hold back two, you will do this lunging overhead, which can pop up into a full combo. The only thing you have to do different is call in Sonya before you do the aerial attack and then you'd want to do the down back four and then that will grant you an easy 350 damage. One thing to note with this move, you have to hold it until it goes by itself. If you if you just tap it, it'll just do a little bitch slap. If you hold it for a little bit, he'll only pull out his claws and it will it'll knock him back but it won't pop him up. So what you gotta do is a full extender. So usually when they're getting up from the ground, you can start this. Also, another another notice is you have to be a little bit close. It can't just connect. It kind of has to connect behind their head, if you know what I mean. Like, like that. You can't you can't be in front of them like that. Another move that I like to use whenever I'm playing footsies with my opponent is a back four. Dodges any medium, high, overheads, really catches the opponent off guard. Another special move that I don't actually u really use as much, which is down up four, which is his invisibility. It takes a while to start up, or 55 frames, but after that you're completely invisible. Usually what I do is I do a jump in, right into a combo. So it's one, 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 spear bomb, jump, boom, boom, boom. And then the death roll after that, but I don't hit my combos apparently. But anyways, the last thing I'll say here is if you're starting up a combo and they see if they're blocking low, try your enhanced dash attack to get out of it. Special cancel. Make sure to enhance it so it will go through for the overhead because if you don't enhance it, it will just stop right there. Enhance it, get the overhead, and continue your turn. Now if they're only blocking up, we can special cancel into the death roll. So either way, no matter which way you're doing your combo starters, you can cancel it out into a special, which makes it continue to be your turn. But anyways guys, if you like this short video, please make sure to like and subscribe, as I will continue to make these little boot camp videos on almost every single damn character in this game, if I have enough time. My content has really been booming and I can't thank you guys enough for it. Make sure to check out the second part of this video that's gonna come out pretty soon, where I take everything that we just learned, put it into a tower, 
And then in the third part, we're gonna go online into the competitive mode. But again, thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Legends never die, we've been going every night. I've been feeling way too blessed, but with Lex, I'm never stressed. They don't know just what we do. We've been out here with the crew. They don't know just how we live. Think we got too much to give. I've been going in and going in.